What's up, everybody? DJ Switch, RadioFreeNerdCore.com, Hit Squad DJ's crew. I have been horrible about putting out my videos. I know. I'm so sorry, you guys. This last several weeks, it's just been crazy busy for me all of a sudden. I mean, I don't get super busy like this uh, very often throughout the year, but the last three weeks, uh, they've all just kind of come together uh, all at the same time. I mean... I played OMSI. I played the Turbine Room at OMSI. I, uh, had a sh- I had a hip-hop show at the Roseland again. I, my second show at the Roseland in two months. Um, I played the Portland Retro Gaming Expo where I was staying in a hotel room for three straight days playing the, at the Retro Gaming Expo. And then, of course, uh, this last weekend, I went to uh, Seaside and stayed in a hotel room there and, and filled in for a friend of mine at a club out in Seaside. Um uh, it just it's been an amazing few weeks i've been um fortunately been making a fair amount of money um and now it's all gone because today i dropped my car off at the mechanics to get the head gasket fixed and i'm suddenly broke again <laughs> um but uh that's not what i wanted to share with you guys today i want to share something really specific and it has to do with uh that rosen gig that i mentioned a couple of weeks back um I was lucky to uh, have a show DJ for that show that didn't. Uh, he had he has similar gear, like it's a very similar setup to what I have. Uh, down to he actually has the same mixer that I do, um, and so he was really cool about me just plugging in my laptop to his stuff, um, and it was all completely compatible, totally worked. And so all that meant is all I needed to bring to the show was my laptop. I didn't have to haul all my turntables, all my gear, all that stuff. And so um, what happened was because I was using his setup, um, I didn't have any kind of a chair or stool or anything that I could sit on. And it forced me to stay on my feet for the entire set. And you guys, I played a 20-minute hip-hop set at a live show on my feet and for the first time in probably two years i don't remember the last time i was i was able to make it through an entire set without sitting down um so i'm extremely excited by that and really proud of that um and then the other thing i wanted to share with you guys is today this morning uh before i went and took my car into the mechanics um i had a really early morning doctor's appointment today with a sleep specialist um, and it's, they're going to address some of the issues that I've been having, uh, with my sleep rotation. And, uh, hopefully that'll give me a little bit more energy so that I can, you know, be awake a little bit more throughout the day. Uh, that means more energy for working out. That means more energy for taking on more gigs. Um, and hopefully that means more energy for, uh, hopefully soon when I'll be able to, uh, join the local YMCA and start doing some swimming and some working out that way. Um, which is all stuff that I kind of had planned, um, you know, eventually, but, um, I got to take care of the car and I got to take care of my family first. So, uh, you know, of course, uh, of course priorities being what they are, but that's here nor there. I, I really wanted to share with you guys, uh, some really exciting news and just let you know that I'm, you know, I'm continuing to try and, and find any kind of physical activity or work out where I can. Um, I feel like I am better and better all the time. Um, there's been a couple of slips where I've, you know, um, I had to spend a few days in bed last week cause I had a little bit of gout in my foot, um, and I couldn't stand on it for, uh, probably three days. Um, but I'm better now. And now that I'm better, I'm, I'm actually glad to be back up and around and moving and be able be able to be on my feet again. So, um, you know, little changes guys. I've been, I've been making a lot of progress. Um, my, you know, a couple of my friends are starting to see it. Uh, my wife is starting to notice more and more, and uh, and I'm definitely starting to notice more and more that, you know, even though it's still a little bit of a struggle, I'm getting out and I'm moving around and I'm being more active, um, being more social, you know, getting more involved in, in some of the things that normally I would just sit on my ass and let the, you know, let these moments in life pass me by. And, and now I'm actually able to take part. So um, it feels really, really good, you guys. It's all a lot of positive stuff, and I, and I really appreciate all of my friends that have been, uh, you know, taking me to task for not posting my videos. Uh, you know, my friends Cecily and Isaiah, um, and especially, especially my friends Jimmy and Bird, uh, who have both been uh, on my case for the last couple of days to get a video out. So, 
Um, this one's for you, you guys, and uh, and thank you so much for continuing to push. Um, without my car this week, I'm going to be stuck at home, so I really need a lot of help from you guys. Uh, let me know what I can do to work out at home when it's rainy and shitty, because I don't think walking down to the park is going to really... Uh, worked that well for me this week with the weather being what it is. So I need ideas, guys. Let me know what I can do to to, to get my sweat on here at home. And uh, I'm you know I'm really open to whatever you guys think. Let me know. Uh, I think that's gonna do it for this one. And I will catch you guys on the next video. This is DJ Switch, RadioForNerdCore.com, His Squad DJ's Crew, five eight seven.